Hello, everybody. It's David Lemon here, and today it is Wednesday. <laughs> we are doing a Groove Pages show and tell again. This is the Groove Pages show and tell number six. This is sixth in the row. Every week we do one on Wednesdays, and this is the time where I actually click on your sites and turn on the camera and tell you exactly what I think about the site. The reason I'm doing this is, again, just to mention what you would need to improve so that your site could be more successful. Um, sometimes I give a bit of uh, feedback and people take it personally. Don't take it personally. This is just for improvement. So in case you created your site and you want to share it with uh, with me, with the world, if you want to know what the, uh, what you could improve or what my feedback is on your site, uh, please share it in the comments of this live stream. I would love to see what you created. Um, yes, at this point, I only received two sites. So in case I don't get your site, so in case you're just jumping on, uh, welcome. I would like to see what you created. So please just take your site that you were working on inside the Groove Pages Builder and publish it, share your site uh, link inside the comments and I will be able to click on it and simply just review it there for you. Um, yeah, so welcome everybody. I'm getting a couple of people joining in. In case you are watching me right now live, please just jump in the comments, say, hi, David, I'm here, or uh, I'm watching or anything like that, just so that I can welcome you personally, read your name, see your profile image, and then may let's make this a uh, conversation between you and me. At this point, I have here Eldon from New Zealand. I have Christine Case commenting, hello, David and everyone. Awesome. Um, Yes, so there's a lot of people joining in now. We have a good crowd on Facebook, very uh, good crowd on YouTube as well. Most of the times these show and tell posts and show and tell uh, live streams are not very popular. It is popular with the people that actually use the builder itself and they want to know what the, they can improve and also what others are doing so they can maybe get some ideas on what to improve. So in case you are working on something, in case Eldon, Christine, Tamara, uh, Lucy, um, TWA, in case you're working on something, just share your uh, sites in the comments and then we'll, we'll uh, review that. However, for today, I prepared something different. Um, as I said, this is the number six of the Groove Pages Show and Tell. So I wanted to go back and see the honorable mentions and actually review them um, the sites that I, that I scored with very, very high rates uh, or very high scores, um, I want to just jump back on it and then show everybody that is new in our Facebook group on what is possible to create uh, with Groove Pages. Um, only this week I've seen, I think, six or seven posts like uh, nobody's actually using Groove Pages or any platform from Groove. This is all just for affiliate things. It is absolutely wrong, and I want to just point to some sites which will prove everything that these naysayers are saying. I, I want to show it. I want to show you guys what you can create with this one. So, yes, I actually have a couple more people joining in. I have a Facebook user saying hello, David. Uh, Nazik Sim is saying hi, David. Um, TWA717. Um, I'm here because I'm considering launching my business with Groove Pages and Groove Digital. Awesome. This is good to know. Uh, you will probably get some awesome ideas from the size I will be showing you later on. F Miami. Hey, David. Good morning. Good morning here. Um, we are at, at this point, I am in Europe and it is um, almost. No, it is past 6 p.m. So it is morning for you. Enjoy that still have a whole day ahead of you. Uh, could you please show how to integrate with PayPal and how... Uh, so this is not the point of this video today. Today we are reviewing um, sites. In case you want to know how to integrate with PayPal, you can actually uh, search for that video on YouTube. There are videos made on that topic. Uh, Debbie is watching us saying hi, David. And... Perfect. Eldon is mentioning in case you are for the first time watching our live streams, for example, this user over here, hello, David, and this user over here, is the replay update available? Um, 
another one from here from ATL. So in case this is you, please head over to streamyard.com forward slash Facebook. This will allow me to actually see your uh, profile image and see your name. So when I'm replying to uh, questions, when I'm giving my answers, I would like to actually say, hey, John, this is the answer to your question. I hear hey Casey or Janet or something like that this is what you need to be uh, aware of this is the reply to your question okay so this is the link you would need to go to and yes I think I will be starting now so if this is the first time you are joining us on the groove pages show and tell I have my uh, trusty uh, document over here with five points over here so this is what I usually follow whenever I'm reviewing a site I want to see the goal of the site, what the creator of the site is asking the visitors to do. Would it be a sign up uh, to the to an email list, uh, download something, buy something, um, join a group, or join something else? Uh, there's different goals that you can you can use uh, on your sites, and this needs to be apparent immediately. It needs to be visible and understandable what the creator of the site wants us to actually do on that site itself. Then the next one is trust factor from one till ten. This is a this is a score from one between one and ten. Uh, just my personal opinion. Uh, then the design, my personal opinion on a one till ten of how I would score the design of the site, brandability of what the brand can be. can be. So there are small businesses which are completely fine, but there are some businesses that the creators of the sites mm, don't even know what is possible to create. So this is where I give a score of how big the, the brand can grow. And then just a summary, the number five is sum up actions to take in case you really want to listen to my advice and go out there so these are the actions you would need to take so that your site uh, is looking better functions better and you actually have more success with it awesome so pim, pim, pim. i have a couple of people joined us more um we are actually there are people asking about uh, the replay the of the webinar from yesterday this is coming and most probably um most probably at the end of this live stream it will be available for everybody so stay tuned i will probably share the link um for you guys before sharing it in the facebook group so in case you're watching just uh stay until the end uh, at this point the replay video is still uploading and encoding so it will need some time if you stay on there and when it's done, I will share the link with you so you can jump on and then uh, actually watch it before everybody else in the group. Good, so that is it. Um, as Eldon is mentioning, in case you have a question, I will be doing a, a Q&A session at the end of the live stream. Um, in case you have like how to do this particular thing, just put a Q dash and then your question uh, typed out, and then this will actually let me uh, easily scroll through all the comments and then answer the question for you. Awesome, so as I mentioned, we have two posts or two, um, two sites that were posted into the official Groove Pages Show and Tell post on the Facebook. There was only five comments, so there were two posts, and then a couple of people just gave their uh, feedback on the sites so the first one is from g w n um so this is a site he says that this is just the first draft so uh, groovefunnels.wtf okay <laughs> i like the i like the domain it is creative so let's just click on it and see what it actually does okay so this is the the free groove funnels account uh vsl this is the new one that we published a couple of days ago he is using, or I mean, I'm actually not quite sure if this is GWN is a man or a woman. So I will just, I will just say he. No apparent reason. I'm just guessing. So here is your beast. Okay, there's a video. Get free access. Okay, that's nice. Are you satisfied? Yes. Pitching, pitching. Get free access. Testimonial, and some some of these q a type of things in free for life okay so let's just see what happens when we click on this button okay so it is actually 
uh, sending us to the affiliate link. Wait for a sec. Before you make your final move, I want to remind you that for a limited time. I'm the co founder of Bufo. And okay. we have a question for you. So it is actually not. Uh, I didn't want to read through and then have the video playing in the background because it would be. Uh, quite bad on the replay of the of this live stream but as i can see that this is a very very early stages of a website or any landing page this is basically just a template that he is using and he just posted inside the video link from groove funnels probably put this logo in there and then wrote here's your beast so I'm not quite sure. I wouldn't be able to comment on this one because this is not finished yet. I know that this is very early stages. However, there would need to be more work done on that part. Um, awesome. So there is a couple of other people that joining that are joining in and actually sharing their their site links. So in case you would like me to review your site. Um, post the links into the description of the live stream. I will go there and then actually uh, get those sites out, review them in front of you, and also review these couple of sites that I want to mention as honorable mentions. Good, so I don't think I will be commenting on this site because this is not finished. So, um, G, once the site is finished, please, pop it in there to the show and tell one more time so other users users can see it and also i can comment on it i i like the the page and how you uh, or how it is laid out it just depends on what kind of content you put in it what kind of uh, text you use uh, but yes i will not be commenting it with my uh, five step uh, five-step review system I will just leave it out and just pop it back once it is finished or close to be finished uh, Chris Sweeney he says I have built a bridge page about groove pages and I used information from the affiliate pages I hope this is allowed okay yes it is allowed if they are interested they choose to go onto the affiliate page I'd like to know I am doing the right thing and not breaching any rules my web page is Chris Sweeney online.com okay so chrisweeneyonline.com, perfect. So Chris Sweeney, very nice logo. It says putting the pieces in place. Okay, Chris Sweeney putting in putting the pieces in place. Nice. Good. Today, get a free lifetime access to the number one page and funnel builder platform, your complete uh, digital product. Okay, the best and easiest way to build funnel and sell digital products. Yes, I want my free lifetime access. Okay, good. So here's the video. Here's a small divider over here. Then I think this is a button. Okay. It looks like a, a heading immediately and not a button. So there's one thing to be fixed. Um, okay. Everything you need to know to sell your products uh, and services online. Here, these are some pointers from the or uh, icon list items from the site itself. Get started right now for free okay breaking news this is from the new website that we have and okay so it is looking good perfect so this site i will be reviewing using this system that i have so the goal of the site is very very clear just to click on this button immediately and then if somebody is watching or actually reading through scrolling through the page there is a couple more times that they have sorry the call to action they can use and then um do the same basically go to that affiliate link that chris is sharing trust factor from one till ten so the trust factor of this site in my opinion is around six the reason is that it needs a bit of more customization and i would like to see some personalization and to be designed for humans um, there's no images except this one over here there's no images only these red check marks so it is looking like it, it was created very quickly and the sites that are that look like they are created very quickly they are usually the ones that get uh, i don't want to be rude but that spammy feeling you probably know when you visited some other sites like uh from products that you uh that you probably clicked on a Facebook ad or something, and it brings you to a site which looks very, very uh, like old style and just uh, just not 
the site was not developed with a lot of time in mind. It was just created very quickly uh, so that it can actually serve the purpose of selling. So I'm not saying that this site is like that, but it would need a bit more time uh, invested. Uh, but Chris is on the good way of having it. So in the, in the design, the, the design is actually the reason why I gave the trust factor uh, a score of six. There is some parts that need some modifications. For example, here, there is a bit of space over here. It would need a bit of space down below here. Um, I'm not quite sure if this is the best position for the video. Uh, maybe to put the video in the first place, like the uh, like G did on on the other side. So he used video as the main selling point, and then he actually put the the button below the video. And he was actually cre he created a, a website where the video is the selling point. Here, Chris is focusing on this button and this heading and the subheading to be the selling point. I think more people would uh, get that trust trustworthy feeling uh, when they see a video and then below the video there is more explanation on it um, so that is my, just my opinion um, the buttons they don't look like buttons they look like um, like some headings with a background uh, color so I would suggest you to duplicate this exact button and then just pull it over here, pull it over here, pull it over here. So do dupli duplicate over this button and just pull it uh, three times on these three positions. It will be making more sense. It looks more like a button. These ones are not very uh, clear that these are buttons and you will probably need, some, need to work a bit on the spacing or positioning of the text on the buttons. Um, it is pretty simple. You just click on the button inside the text you click the text to be centered, and that's basically it. Um, yes, so the design, as I mentioned, it needs a bit of more images or or something to make it more live. Um, I will show you a couple of uh, good examples um, that I that I want to mention. These honorable mentions, they have a lot of lifestyle images, a lot of uh, movement and people and faces and things like this. Um, you have the video over here, but everything else is kind of blank. So people cannot trust something like this only in case they know your name as Chris Sweeney. Just put a, put an image of yourself and just your short review like this. Guys, this is truly the best system I ever used for creating funnels and something like this. Even your image would increase the trust factor of the site immediately. So this is just something uh, that I think is important. Um, brandability. So I don't know what you want to focus on with the Chris Sweeney online, but in case you are trying to uh, to do promotions for different platforms, not only for GrooveFunnels, this is possible. So there is a lot of personal brands like um, Tony Robbins and Russell Brunson and then Gary Vaynerchuk and... Um, Marie Forleo as a as a lady. So there is a lot of different brands that are actually uh, personal brands and they built out their site and they provided content and things like this using their own name as the brand name. So in case you're focusing on something like that, find the niche, find the thing that you are good, uh, good in and then market that, sell your solutions. And actually... Um, this is the way you would be able to, to do a lot of uh, of money and basically focusing on personal branding. Um, this is just my opinion. You can do huge, huge money with this personal brand. It just depends how deep you want to go into this. So brandability is a score of 10. Design is a score of seven so trust factor six design seven brandability is 10 sum up actions to take just fix a bit of design put in some pictures of people maybe play with the play with the video position in case you just put the video in the first place and then the rest uh below that i think it would look better maybe not with the whole background image at the top but try to model something like uh what for example uh, we have inside the Groove pages uh, template options. Try to use a template and then use the same content that you have. 
just position the content inside the template it would look much better the design would be higher the, the trust would be higher and also use some of your own images or some images uh, from like stock images or, or testimonials or something like that so this is just my recommendation and using that you would get your site way above others that just use this type of thing no personalization no colors no images uh, this would make your site and the chris uh, chris sweeney brand boost up okay that was the site that was posted on here so these were the two uh two posts let me just come over here and actually find the live stream where you guys are putting in your own um putting in your own sites um yes so as you can see i will be revealing some of the sites that i reviewed previously the yes there is a a comment here the problem with the button is left biased on text center the text and make it look like real button not highlighted headline rectangle correct yes so this is what i i meant to say if i didn't say it correctly uh this is what i meant mm. David Bennett is asking, can we get the URL for that site in the chat box? Um, it was Chris Sweeney. I'm not quite sure. I wouldn't. I already exited out of that, but I will try to find it and then pop it into the uh, into the comment section there. But let me just try to find. Oh, okay. So I have Nicole again. Uh, awesome. I also have Eddie posted his site, so I want to. I want you to guys to see this site. I I am really happy. Actually, last time when I reviewed it, it was kind of a ooh. I'm not quite sure, but actually, I I, I grew to like this site. This is a site from uh, Nicole Wynn. fmiami.com is her site, and she is focusing on really creative type of design. And I think this is. This is something that you don't see a lot. So let me just show it to you. Uh, cookie usage policy. Okay, I like this one. She actually put the cookie usage in a pop-up, which is quite nice. Okay, good. Let me just see if I can exit. Okay, so it didn't fully work, but it doesn't matter. Okay, so there were some changes from last time last time it didn't look like this i really like this nicole i don't know how you created these but it looks like the image is getting separated into cubes uh intricately put together <laughs> awesome um so yeah mr priceless okay introducing mr priceless so the magic happens once you come to the to the pineapple and you click on the pineapple um so Anis is asking what the site called. The this site is effemiami.com. Okay, so click on the pineapple, and this is where the magic happens. Ooh, it looks completely different than last time. Okay, so there is some music from YouTube going on here. I <laughs> I like this one over here. It is a different image than what it was uh, last week. Uh, cool. So let's get down to it. Awesome. So this is this is a very creative spin on different sites that you can see online. So don't judge it as every other site there. Okay, there's F Miami intro. It's 14 seconds. Let's just watch it together. So there's some music. Okay, so I think she is using now this as her logo. Cool. Our vision keeps you at the center throughout the longe longevity of our relationship, from refreshingly pleasant shopping experience to well-timed opportunities for the entire family. We are rolling out the red carpet straight to the comfort of your home. Nicole Wynn, CEO. Awesome. Cool. A lifetime loyalty to honest business, period. Okay. Follow the purple arrows for unexpectedly exclusive experience. Nice. I like this text. Uh, marketing hub so let's just click on the on the f this is a page number four Ooh, this uh, pineapple has a chain now around his neck sneak peek at the greatest marketing hub known to date in our opinion okay um so i think there's a video somewhere because i can see oh there is some video um it is auto playing so 
Okay, so plug Miami assets, Miami best music, Miami best art, Miami. Okay, have you ever wanted to meet the plug plug online? I'm not quite sure what is it selling. This is our collection of quality sound that might be unheard for no other reason other than animals need love too. Uh, I'm not quite sure. I think you are selling some kind of of music or <laughs> I'm not quite sure. But okay, so I'll just go out and click on this one. So this is uh, promoting Groove. Okay, get yourself in Groove and make substantial move. <laughs> Don't miss on the mark. Don't miss out on the most powerful tour for entrepreneurs. Okay, so there's a sign up button. Maybe this button needs to be a bit bigger. Um, this can and will change your position on the totem pole if you act now. I like this. <laughs> freedom. Yeah, that's the button. What it says, freedom. I like it. Um, uh, it looks cool. It is mm, a lot different than what I've seen previously. Puka Garden in development. Okay, so let's just click on it. Apple4pot.com. The complete kit for grow pot at home. Okay, good. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so good. I think this will be interesting for some kind of uh, some people. Best outdoor and indoor marijuana growing kits. Good. This is actually like this. Maybe I look into this one. Probably it is not legal in my country, but we'll just need to see <laughs> but yes so nicole i have no comments on this one i really cannot score it from one till ten as i mentioned previously this is completely different for from what i've seen i really like your creative spin in it and i and i just encourage you to continue uh with what you have you are thinking differently and this is what makes you unique so i encourage you just to continue just build out what you have and show the world who you are. I don't have any other thing to say. Uh, I will not even try to go into these because I just cannot comment. It is very nice and you created uh, awesome stuff from last week. You changed over some images. You you put uh, more uh, graphics and illustrations and you made sure that the text is visible now. So I'm really happy about that also put in a lot of different videos so good job i see you are improving as well and your learning uh, or knowledge of the platform is just getting better and better so yeah that's it this was nicole's site um let me just review another site from another user that we have here watching our live stream this is adi at this site and unlimitedfunnel.com okay so unlimited funnel e-commerce um 99 dollars uh, platform to build websites and uh, funnels free for a limited time better way to sell digital products and services your complete digital products and service online system okay so this is using also our template um Addy added on his logo um and you probably just changed over the the buttons yeah so the buttons are all leading over to to add his uh pro affiliate link um there's privacy policy using the privacy policy generator okay perfect In terms of service as well In terms of service uh terms and conditions uh generator that's fine um yeah so adi i don't actually see a lot of customizations it looks to me like the like the template what we have inside the template gallery um so it looks very good the design is very good i just don't like the the logo so the logo with the whole pink and gray uh, sorry the gray and the green um these ones it just doesn't work well so maybe if you could do uh, like a gray or a black version of your logo black and white uh, these petals uh, would look better and maybe just just decrease this uh, the size of this block over here this container that is holding your your image if you decrease it then the people will not need to scroll solo uh, to actually see the content um yes that's my opinion and the other ones 
over here as well but everything else is just using the template from the builder it looks good you would just probably need to do some more customization because a lot of other people will be using the same uh, template so when we publish a template we want you to see how, what can be created not just to use the in immediate exact uh, style what it is in the template um, what templates are for is to actually see the layout change over your text change over your images um, put in your colors put in your images like logos and such and then actually publish that as a customized versions of the template in case you're using these pre-made templates and just putting on your links there will be a lot of different users doing that as well and you will not be anything special look at what nicole is doing that is absolutely special i haven't seen anybody uh, promoting groove using those kinds of site uh, sites and she's putting a, a another level of creativity inside it or customizations and things like this but once you're using just these pre-made templates you need to make sure you customize them a bit um so it doesn't actually make sense for me to to go through through this one because this was created by professionals in our company and it's just very apparent the the goal the design the the trust factor once you're looking aside like looking at the site like this is just very apparent that this was created by by professionals so try to take examples from from this image just download it and create your own image looking similarly um the text and these uh these pointers or i don't even know how how you call them so these uh features of the of the app you can leave but maybe put your own uh own text your own copy try to do a bit more a bit less than what it is in the template okay so let me just come over here and click on different sites I'm actually just searching for your sites, guys. So bear with me just for a moment. I will try to open them here. So I have Cheryl Coleman. Baby Beth. I'm actually just is sharing her site. And this is her site over here. Soap making. Ooh, this is looking nice. Bath and Body Scientist. Bubble up excitement nice um i love immediately the logo is is beautiful bath and body scientist the, the fonts are nice and the the colors are matching on the site so i'm happy with that she has a couple of things going on here so there is some kind of presentation if i'm correct or some kind of a video click here to play okay i'm not quite sure what kind of Um, what is this actually? Um, or I'm not quite sure what this is. This is to this is some kind of add to add to any dot com widget, which looks kind of nice. It all also displayed my my profile image, which basically allows the app to access some of my details. So that's quite cool. Um, and then she also has this widget over here for help, powered by Bath and Body Scientist. Okay, cool. So this is like a live chat thingy, which is very important nowadays to have something like that. Okay, so she is actually selling her digital product, if I'm correct. Um, how would you like to become your very own Bath and Body Scientist? Learn the insider secrets of professional Bath and Body product creators. Used to create soaps, lotions, bath bombs, fizzies, perfumes, and foam fragrance products. Okay. 138 page step by step guide, tips on selling your items, customizable recipes. Nice, good. Um, so, this is very interesting. Uh, so let me just start with my system over here. So the goal of the site is to actually purchase it, but I'm missing a call to action button over here. Somewhere in the first part, you, 
you shouldn't have immediately privacy policy and contact us. This is not the the goal of what you're trying to do. So probably make these these two buttons somewhere at the bottom of the page. And then this download now, just put over here instead. So the goal of your page needs to be immediately apparent for, for everybody when they join. They need to know what you are actually doing. So just give them give them an indication, download now or buy now or join now or something like this. This needs to be the goal of your site. At this point, it is privacy policy and contact us. Uh, you also have your working hours and your phone over here. So it is lo it is looking like you you are asking people to contact you and not to purchase from you. Even though there is a mock-up of a, of a notebook over here or actually a step-by-step -step guide, uh, you would need to give them or just give the customers or your visitors a big call to action. Download this product, okay? The first place where they can see it is over here and they have to scroll down. When they are viewing it on mobile, okay, I can, I can see you didn't... Uh, fully optimize it yet for mobile but they would need to scroll down a lot so that they can see the actual uh, actual call to action button over there here's some of what you will receive okay so these are some features and benefits okay so this is a little bit more selling it then there is this video over here and now the call to action button there are some testimonials over here which is looking good in the bath and body scientist you will learn the basics, pam pam pam. So this is what you will learn. Download now. Uh, cool. So it is looking interesting. The trust factor from one till ten is seven. Seven, and this is only because there is no personalization. I can see there is some uh, some people over here, but I would like to see in case you are the Bath and Body Scientist and you created this company, maybe you could come on to, to uh, just put a picture of yourself or something like that and then actually um, show up or say, hi, this is, this is me, this is Cheryl, or this is Janet or this is whoever. Um, some people call me the Bath and Body Scientist, and I would like to teach you how to do da 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 da. So it it becomes more personal with uh, with your you become the brand, and the brand becomes connected to you. So in case you're creating it for somebody else, I would suggest you to try to get them on to to share something personal to to show that they are human uh, and there are people behind this one. Um, so yeah, and the, the design, it needs some more, uh, some more spacing. The more you space, space it out, the more, uh, nicer it looks. For example, this one, as you can see, is not looking as nice as this one because here it has, uh, enough spacing here. It has enough spacing between these. It, there's enough spacing between the white part and the gray part over here. Um, there's enough spacing, so this is just my opinion. You would need to uh, work on spacing and margins and paddings and things like this just to give it a bit of more professional design look. Um, this part is fine. This part is fine. This Bath & Body Scientist, I'm, I'm pretty sure you were struggling with actually putting this part onto the background itself. Um, I received a couple of comments from people that didn't know how to do it and you would just need to go to the elements tab, pull in a one column element, pop it into this background over here and then you would be able to do that. Um, then you can just pop in the, the text onto that container uh, which you just pulled in and this is the same thing for the download now button. You would be able to put here a container inside the background image so that you can have like one section talking about this. Um, Cheryl saying, got it, but have huge fear of videoing myself. That's fine, Cheryl, no problem. You don't have to come on video. You can just um, create something like this. Let me just show you the video that we have on, on Facebook, sorry, on YouTube. You probably know Simon. Simon is working in our company, but you probably never seen him. And I will show you why. So this is a video from Simon. And what he does here is actually says, hi, I'm Simon Liang. And he has a picture in the background. 
here we go so this image is there for two seconds you see now it's zero zero two and his image is not visible anymore but he said hi i'm simon leong and today i want to da 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 and he never comes back to the whole video so through the whole video he's just talking about the product and and basically uh what it can do and features and benefits and things like this he never actually comes back to to show his face again you don't have to come on camera you can create something like this just show a picture of yourself so that it is more personalized you introduce yourself you just say hi i'm cheryl and this is, some people call me the uh what's the name of bath and body scientist uh in case you were wondering how to actually create your own uh lotions and and uh, soaps and bath bombs uh, i have an awesome product for you i created this guide a step-by-step -step guide where you, you can learn bam 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 and then you actually do this video you don't also have to have video you can do that in inside just uh like put an image on your site and then create like a testimonial thing uh where you actually have a picture of yourself um, you could do something like this so just an image and then in a container you just place in some information hi i'm the person behind the bath and body scientist um welcome to my page or something like this just show up just mention that this is you and it it will increase the trust factor immediately um so at this tr moment trust factor is seven the design is eight the design is eight because it just needs a bit of spacing it just needs a bit of more customization and then i think it will be looking pretty cool um i'm not sure how i feel about these columns over here i think this would look better if this is one product over here and then the text on this side then another product image over here and then the text on this side when you stack these up like that it is actually looking a bit crowded um, so maybe something to think about we have blocks where it actually has um, image text then you can you can just swap this one you duplicate this and then you put the image over here text over here and then you duplicate it and then again image here text here so it looks a bit better than stacking up uh, images and a lot of text like this into these columns um it's a lot to focus at the same time so this is why you would be able to just separate them uh it would look better so the design is eight as i said brandability this could be this could be quite big you could be an expert inside the inside the bath and body and create your own soaps and lotions and things like this uh field i f i would focus on pinterest pinterest is your biggest mm, like market um maybe just leave out the privacy policy contact us over here mention or maybe uh, i don't know pinterest is where you should uh, get your traffic because there are people interested in this exact topic um but you could also create your own blog you can create videos on this one you said that you are not very um uh, you're shy on videos but you could maybe create like videos like on youtube they have uh up and remedies or something like this remedies up and remedies and they actually create these kind of uh images image videos where where they actually do top 10 okay not this one but uh they actually show up only the they actually show images and they talk in the background of it um this is not the best video that i chose for this purpose but but i'm, I'm pretty sure you know what i mean uh, so something like this so they actually never show their 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 faces they just show what they do and things like this so maybe videos like this which you can create you can uh you can get uh ideas from youtube from pinterest from facebook groups and you can actually be an expert in in this kind of field so something to think about um some up actions to take just work on your spacing and here you absolutely have to have a call to action button move away these uh, these buttons the contact us or the phone is not the most important when you're selling a digital product like this and they this is a digital product so you don't even have to show your online hours or hours online um it's a website so you can absolutely leave this out you don't need this uh this whole block uh, everything else is cool and this one you would i would suggest you to 
to try and play with the different styling of image text because people watch uh, and scan uh, websites in sections so one section first another section and then if you put a lot of details like this in one section it becomes actually a lot a crowded and it's like too you need to focus a lot and actually read it through focus 100% so that you actually read through everything that there is in, on these pages so that's just something you need to think about uh, okay so I have Keisha is joining us on the <laughs> on the uh, show and tell I was actually helping Keisha she had uh, big problems with her site uh, it wouldn't publish and then it was not it was not online for some reason so we hopefully managed to sort out most of the issues um, so yeah I will probably come to your site as well Keisha just hold on for a second uh, there is Tina Grave Joiner showing her site which is called Stir Crazy Designs Awesome. I like the the name of it. Okay, I don't know why I copied the Facebook link, but okay. So this is a Shopify site. Yeah, it's a Shopify site. So uh, Tina, we are on these show and tell. I know you are trying to get your review and maybe uh, show off your site, and it is looking very nicely. However, I will focus only on Groove Pages sites in these Groove Pages show and tell videos. Um, thank you for for submitting your site, and hopefully, once you actually created your site inside Groove Pages, we can review it. But for now, I would just jump over it. It is nothing personal. It's just that I want to focus on, on uh, the customers and the sites that were created inside Groove Pages. Um, okay, there is Antonika Chanel or Channel. I'm sorry, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it. I, I think it is Chanel. Um, let me just pull it over here. Let me see if this is. It doesn't look like it is. Um, don't think that this is a Groove Pages site. Um, Antonica, I would love to review it here for you, but as I said to uh, to the previous users, this is a Groove Pages show and tell, and I will be reviewing the Groove Pages show and tell sites. I can see you are doing some awesome work, but once you create your site on Groove Pages, I would love to to get my view on it. Um, good. So here is Keisha with the groovepreneur.com. Um, let's just have the, the site load in here. Okay. So this is the groovepreneur.com. Okay, this is Keisha over here. And let me just see. Mm. Bum, bum, bum. Good. So this is her site. There was a issue for some reason. The pop up which she had on her site was causing big issues. Let's just see if it is actually working now. So we are going to the next page over here. Okay. So Groove Cell, Groove Pages, Groove Card, Groove Affiliate, Groove Member. Bum bum bum. Okay. Everything is mentioned. Uh, let me just zoom out a bit. This is hundred percent for me. So I'll just review it like that. Um, Platinum Software Package. Okay. Good. I'm not quite sure why this is so transparent over here. Maybe, Keisha, you would need to look at this one. Um, here are some reviews, which she actually used the um, the help and affiliate outpost to, to find the real customers' reviews about the, about the software itself. Yes, upgrade my request to Platinum. Bitly. Okay, so this is transferring the customers over to, the, to her affiliate link. That is nice. Good. Groovepreneur. This is linked. Okay, so this is actually not linked. Um, cool. So if in case people want to go back, they would probably want to click on this one. I'm thinking she created this as a as a funnel so that you cannot go out of it, which is okay. Um, good. So it is looking very similarly as it looked previously. I'm pretty sure you worked on it a lot from the last time, but no thanks okay 
I'll just go with a free upgrade. Okay, perfect. Good. So this is an also an option. Wow, upgrade my request to Pro instead. Okay, so it is actually sending them to a uh, to Groove Funnels uh, or the Groove uh, Pages Pro immediately. And there is also a no thanks button, which is actually sending people to the free account just to sign up for the free. Uh, Free account there it is looking nice uh, good job Kisha and this is what I say guys so she created a site that is actually doing the same thing as a lot of other users she's promoting uh, group funnels but she had her own creativity her own spin on it she had her own colors and uh, images and mock-ups created and she created a, a video as well um, introducing the product she's showing that she's an actual person and I'm very happy about this site. Goal immediately, the yellow button, it, you cannot miss it. Where is it? Here. I'm so in, um, you cannot miss it. So this is the goal to click on that button. Trust factor is very high. She's actually showing herself over here. She's talking about the product. She actually put in the time to create all this uh, all this content, all the pages, and it is looking looking very very nice and designed and personalized um so i would i would score the trust factor as 10 i would definitely uh, if if i wouldn't know anything about this i would probably watch the video first then look into all these options then probably think okay this is a scam then maybe google it but Keisha gives a lot of different uh information already on this site here as well so this is how i would look through this site uh then maybe the only thing I'm missing here is maybe here to include some testimonials as well because what's the catch? And then you can show there's no catch. Here is what the real customers say. This is something you could add on. Maybe just duplicate the other uh, th that block from the other page that you have, Keisha, and then maybe you can put it over here. This would, this would look even better. Design, I don't have anything else to add on. Design is pretty nice, pretty cool. I will rate it as 10. Uh, brandability, as with every affiliate, uh, every affiliate site, you can actually brand this um, up to the level that you want. In case you just want to leave it as a small affiliate site, you can do that. In case you want to actually create uh, a lot of different content on Groove and a lot of different content on each of the platforms which are out and which will be coming out you can actually create your own kind of uh following something like angie norris did she created a groove stars a facebook group which is almost a thousand members big and she's helping out like crazy and she's supporting her members and she puts out a lot of content around that so you could do something like that as well as a group partner um yeah, some up actions to take. I don't have anything else to add, just maybe to think about uh, adding on testimonials over there. And then I think you have a really nice site on your hands, Kisha. And I'm pretty sure you are already promoting to it. So go, girl. <laughs> Good. Let me just see if there are any other sites. Pum, pum, pum. Adrienne Mitford. Okay, this is a Groove Pages site. Let me just click on it and then see what she has going on. Ooh, nice. Small business owners, five must follow steps to build your online business with ease. Have you ever sat for hours trying to figure out technology or pulled your hair out for frustration? Do you want to help but aren't sure where to turn? Um, download this free toolkit to get started right away with building your own business with ease awesome so this is something that is actually useful and people can just type in their email and get that toolkit um it is very simple this is the whole whole landing page um yeah let's just review it so the goal is immediately apparent enter your email and get the toolkit it even says um okay download this free toolkit and get started right away so even even though some people think that uh, the customers will know what to do you need to mention what you want them to do so like this download the toolkit to get started right away building your online business with ease so it is a good idea to actually point it out immediately and straight like 
f fair and square what you want them to do. This is good. Um, trust factor. Trust factor is high. However, I wouldn't put this white part in. I'm not quite sure uh, what I feel about this one. Um, it looks like you wanted to continue your site, but you stopped doing uh, doing this one. Maybe if you just use this part, the blue part, and make it full screen. Let me just quickly show you how you would be able to do that. Um, so when we are in Groove Funnels in the Groove Pages, um, let me just do it over here. So let's just imagine that. Let me delete this first. Let's just imagine that this is the blue part on your site, and I will just make it blue like yours, something like that. So I have this block selected now. Like you can see the, the star over here, and it says block. Then you know that you are in the block section. So when you go to the sizing, in the height option, choose relative to the page and pull it all the way up until you see 100 VH. This is a viewable height or visible height. So on each of the device, it will be 100% of the visible height of the screen. So this is something that I would I would suggest you to use in this type of build when you have something like this. Maybe you would put the blue part in the 100% visible height and then the rest uh, you could delete because this one doesn't say a lot actually if you want you can add on this white part but then add on something more or something else because it is like it is looking like an incomplete site this way um it is up to you this is just my opinion but the trust is is high it would be higher if it would be only one part or more parts uh below the the, the blue section at this point it is it is nine you have a very professionally looking font. Uh, this form over here, the button looks great. The the colors are uh, are universal, or you're following the same colors on the side. So blue, green, these are your colors, and then you're playing with the shades of black, gray, and uh, black, gray, and white. So this is looking very professional. Uh, yeah, design. I don't have anything else to say. Only to either continue building it or just delete this white part. Um, brandability, I'm not quite sure what you are trying to do. There is no logo, there is no domain, there is no points pointers of what uh, you are creating. Okay, let me just try to, to, to sign. I don't think you you connected your, your autoresponder. Just see what it... Yeah, I don't think this is working yet. This is just maybe uh, still in the setup mode. But but yes, you're on a good way. Um, actions to take, just the one thing. Either continue building it, which I suggest you do. Um, point out multiple things that the, the book will mention uh, or these uh, this program toolkit will mention. Um, and just just maybe say how it can help you um it you say who this is for but what can what can it do for you um maybe just point that out in the in a section below and you can then finish finish this landing page but that's it these are my opinion this is my opinion and but yes let me just see if there are any other sites on here beep, 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 beep. But yeah, guys, um, even though if there are no other sites, unlimited funnel, okay, there is Prakash actually shared his own. So let me just click on his. Prakash is a very active uh, member in our group. So I'm happy to give my opinion on his site. It is looking nice, very well spaced out. Good. Perfect. Nice. So the goal of the site is immediately to get in touch and fill out this one over here um enter your taluk i'm not quite sure what taluk is but good um it is the, the goal of the site is just to to to, to fill out this form trust factor well on the trust factor i don't like the logo the logo doesn't doesn't work with it is not looking professionally, in my opinion. If you would have it only white, 
the logo would look very very nice however this two colored logo and there is some kind of a hat over here like this uh when you finish school then you have this kind of a black thingy i don't know what this is called so don't make fun of me but um this is when you graduate then you have that kind of uh something on your head this is also here but it's not visible so in case you would just make it white it would be better uh, study mbbs abroad in top universities in the world stethoscope is the on only jewelry that uh, can be earned by money it can be earned by passion and hard work great this is actually uh, a good add-on to the whole thing here top countries for indian students to study uh, study mbbs abroad okay good is this a clickable no it is not clickable um but yeah it is very apparent what he wants us to do so prakash good job you explain a little bit of what you are doing on the site what you want the, the customers to what actions to take and you give them another call to action over here once they actually fill out this one they can go and find you on different social media you can also call and email which is quite nice so that is great trust factor the trust factor because of the logo i would rate it uh nine but even though the logo and, and and that is not a big deal, the the whole, for example, in a design section, I wouldn't put these borders around the images and around this one, around these. It, it, you don't need it. This is just an extra element that is just crowding over overcrowding the the design. Just leave it as simple as possible. Try to focus on a couple of colors. In case you're using blue over here and over here just try to focus on that blue i can see that you're using this orange or blue or red from the logo but i don't think this is needed just focus on the blue to be your your main color and everything else can be black and white and gray um yeah so this was the design the design is actually nine because of these colors uh, but the layout and everything is very very nice Brandability, I don't know anything about this MBBS abroad and universities and studying. Um, so it could be big, it could be small. I have no clue. Um, I don't know what he is actually uh, creating or what is the next step after somebody applies. So I'm, I cannot comment on that. Actions to take, just remove this orange from your, from your pages. Try to do a black and white version of the logo and yeah i think that would be it maybe get a professional email in case you are medicon overseas and you're actually sending people all over the world people don't feel that confident when you have a gmail it doesn't make a lot of difference but if you have medicanoverseas.com or info at medicanoverseas.com it it is looking much better than than just the medicanoverseas at gmail.com you can do a free account. I created a video on that one on YouTube. Uh, you can find it. It's a uh, branded email proof pages. You're getting a professional email address with your domain that is connected to Groove Pages. So you can watch this. Um, you can watch this video, and it will actually explain you how you can get a free. Um, info at yourdomain.com uh, email and connect it to group pages so that is it prakash thank you very much for sharing your site let me just see if there are any other if there are not okay so there is nikhil mital shared his site i'm not quite sure if this is healthlounges.in It is not loading in for me. Uh, so healthlounges.in is, is not loading in for me. Um, Nikhil, so you probably need to check it out. Why is it not loading? But yes, as I mentioned, I will be going over some honorable mentions. The first site is James Jernigan. He posted his site in, the, in one of the first um, show and tell sessions that we had. Um, and he actually took my 
advice and he created an awesome site he actually po pointed his camera towards his face and he just uh, said my name is james jeringan and i want to tell you about uh the software that can help you you don't need a credit card da, 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 da. And he actually shows and and guides the people through what you can do with this one a very simple site look look how simple it is it's just one block over here with a text over here a text over here a video element, a button, and some more text over here. There's nothing extra, but it looks so simple and so professional because he is showing up in the video and he's talking and he is uh, nice and and like uh, bubbly and helpful. People will click on the get start because he is mentioning it a couple of times in their uh, learn more, click the get start button, uh, get this on your hands. Like this is one-time opportunity and things like this it is very simple you can do that yourself you don't need to use any of the templates uh we have in our template library this can be created in i don't know i can create it in two minutes i'm pretty sure you can create it in in half an hour or an hour yourself um I have a question from Matthias. How is he driving traffic i'm not quite sure he joined us on one of our first uh show and tells so he was not participating in this show and tell. He didn't post his site, but I have a document where I document all the the site where uh, people what people shared on the show and tell, and I referred back to it. And just browsing around, I saw that he actually uh, took my advice and created something awesome, and I really like it. If people click on the get started, they are going to to his affiliate link. So very simple. There's nothing that you cannot do. Uh, Point your camera. This is a phone, uh, and he even like I'm pretty sure this is his phone because he over here he is turning it off over here. Look at him. Thanks. So he's turning on turning off the cameras. It doesn't have to be professional. It's not important what you wear, how you look like. It's the information and your personality that will take the take over the the visitors on the page. Uh, of course, don't look like you woke up just like three seconds before you're recording that video but even that is showing of your personality like oh i just woke up but i keep thinking about this software about da 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 da, da. you can make actually make fun and make creative spins on that um he decided just to be uh, straight into a camera and explaining it what i really like guys is that he created subtitles look at this one let me just make it a bit more uh it's total. It's very simple. He put in uh, subtitles so that people can actually follow, even if they are looking uh, or watching from a mobile phone and they don't want to have the sound on. They can watch through the video and then read through the video as well. So, something to to think about when you're creating your affiliate site. The next honorable mention is. Classy and sassy. <laughs> this was a show and tell. Uh, basically, you can see here set for live groovepages.com forward slash show and tell forward slash classy. This is from one of our uh, active users in the in the group who actually created his uh, site. Look at this. So this is his homepage over here. It is pretty nice. So these are all screenshots. You cannot do anything with this. Then here is our blog, a blog landing, then a contact page, videos page, a blog layout. It's an um, opt-in page over here, um, blog page again, sales page, upsell page, opt-in pop-up, thank you page. Like it is, I, he created all these pages. He did a, a screenshots of it. But everything here is created in Groove Pages, and everything here can be created by you as well. It nothing is out of the ordinary and, uh, and extremely hard. I'm pretty sure he was using most of these blocks were uh, pre-made inside the, the the builder. So everything you see on this page is created in Groove Pages. So all these sites, all these blocks, all these pages, everything is created in, inside Groove Pages. So I just wanted to mention it. People that were saying, oh, nobody uses this and nobody builds sites. 
this is absolutely not true look what james is doing look what this site looks like it's just it's just crazy what you can create this next site you probably know in case you are, are familiar with angie norris this is a, one of the sites that she created and it is extremely simple in case you look at it but she added on her own styling uh, in css so let me just uh, show you what you can do with this for example once you hover over this uh, image there is a slight animation that comes in and what once you click on it this will stay on here look at it so if i hover it shows up once you click on it it actually stays same thing here so she actually put in some text inside the the css code and then she animated these um um these containers so these are containers which in the background have their image and then using css she uh, she put on the text and she animated the uh, the background and and things like this so it is pretty cool what she created it is very creative and i i highly encourage you to 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 be creative with your site don't do just what everybody else is doing think about something that you could maybe innovate on on your site like for example what nicole is doing so here just an image with some text um here is a block with some different images that again have some css styling on it uh, you don't have to do css styling even without that the images are looking awesome um again some feature block over here some more block basically she has an awesome background image and then here she has some uh, creative looking uh so these are, I think, images over here um, that are put in the background of the container. So it is looking pretty cool. Then here, another image with some text on the side. Then another, uh, so here is a text, here is a button, here is an image. This is the same thing, it's just the opposite. So here is the image, here is some text, here is a button, and things like this. So embedded, she embedded also a checkout uh, check out form inside her page she is promoting a birthday extension that you can purchase and also add um, you can also give it out as a bonus so you purchase this um, offer and you can give it out as a bonus when you're promoting for example groove funnels or something like that yeah, so this is Angie Norris's site, birthdayextension.com. This was created with group pages. And then you can right click on it, and then you can see here it is saying GP component, GP component, which is group pages component. There we go. Out uh, there. And here is another site that was showing up a couple of weeks ago on our show and tell. And this is from, I think, Paul. He shared it with us, and he is the health navigator, and he is actually promoting his book over here, uh, which is also having an audio version, so you can download the audio versions as well. You have different testimonials here. You have different uh, descriptions, and um, yeah, so Paul Keenan. So this is him over here. You, you see, it doesn't have to look extremely hardcore or complicated um he put an image of himself meet the author and that is enough there is not a lot of different images except this one is a stock photography except the, the testimonials there's not a lot of images that you people can refer to okay this is uh, created by a, a robot or something but here at the end he actually stops them and says hi this is me, this is the author, Paul Keenan. I became sick uh, 30 years ago and now I found a solution on this and this and that. And then he's actually promoting an, uh, an offer that he has a personal um, connection with. So it is looking very simple and you can create something like that. This is not very hard. You need to follow a couple of design principles like the colors need to be uh, matching, like this red is the same as this red. He has... Uh, uh, the play with white gray and black he has uh, yellow to help some things on the page stand out but everything else is very uniform so red black uh, white gray and yellow just in a couple of places basically these are his colors he's following uh, very um, strict rules in fonts and sizes and things like this so 
but you can do that yourself it is not very hard okay i wanted to show this site this is a site of created by uh marsha i think the funnel builder that's her name on facebook so i'm just uh i'm just mentioning it she created uh i'm not sure if this is for her or for the company cusat um she created this funnel look at it uh, how beautiful this is and it is on uh on groovepages.com hosted domain so it is pretty simple you can get your free samples and then here is a checkout form from from groove cell it is it is pretty simple how it was created and yeah you can just follow these types of sites which i which i showed and you can you can start creating something yourself so this is a site that i reviewed i think um two weeks ago this is a site from matty paul and he he is this person over here as you can see um he shows up in in an image which is very important in these kinds of sites as i showed you um he's actually promoting a, a free copy of a book uh, where he talks about uh uh, identity theft and securing your children from from identity theft and things like this um this is a an interesting uh interesting product and he has a very awesome site which is also not very hard to do in case you just just look what is on the side so here is a block with some text and a countdown timer then the next block has a background image with a blue overlay and here is an image over here here is some text, but more more text and a button. Very simple. Here is a two column layout, two column, so one block which has two columns over here. In one column he has this heading, then some icon list items, then this image, and then this is another two columns. So in one column he has an image, and in other column he has some text. So in case you just just have a look at the site, what it consists of, what is it made of you can simply recreate it it is not very hard um so yeah i just wanted to show you what is possible uh, because i wanted to prove the naysayers wrong that were saying you cannot build anything with groove pages nothing usable it is not true you can build it and these people are actually running their businesses off of groove pages sites so there you go booyah um okay i can see nikhil is still trying to actually uh, get his site up and running here we go so he actually got it back so this is his site this is the last website i will be reviewing today um, let me just see i think this is done in groove pages because i'm familiar with the pop-up seven in one offer we deliver nothing less than the highest value at the price which no one gives in the bi faced health industry diet consultation diet plan uh workout da, da, da. okay good I, I'm missing a call to action over here. Good, seven in one offer, but what then? You need to give them a, a, an option to to do something. Um, okay, it is very colorful. Let's just have a look. I'm not sure what this image is about. It is a bit mixed up. I think you need to work on the sizing of the images. I think these are... Um, I think these are screenshots, but you were probably having difficulties with the sizing, so you would need to look into it. But the goal of the site, I don't see any call to action. Limited seats, do you, you, you would need to have a button that we can click. I don't know what your... Uh, goal is you need to give them like click here to do this i don't see anything like that on the whole site pay oh there's a pay button over here pay for what um this is okay but you would need to you would need to oh you need to explain it a bit better nikhil um slim fit challenge okay so this is early bird offer get instant access one low price um, this immediately shows up you need to give them a call to action if, if you show this up on an entry. Um, yes, the site is looking very colorful. You would need to, to focus on just a couple of col colors, in my opinion, or 
the trust factor of this site is, I would say, five because it is nicely styled. So there is a lot of spacing everywhere, but there's too many colors. Design is, I would say, four because it is this text is, I think, different from this text than the colors are. So the logo is kind of a bluish green. And then the background of it is black. Then uh, this one is orange. Then this one is green. And then this one is uh, kind of a red and pink. And and I don't know. I don't understand the yellow part over here. Um, so this would probably need to be looked into it. Mm, yes, but I wouldn't rank it more than uh, than four in the design uh, it needs some work you need to design your brand colors you need to design your logo where it will be you need to give them a goal you need to give them buttons and then to just to look through those images that are uh, not showing up nicely on the on the site it needs a bit of more, more love brandability i don't know what you're planning to do with the slim fit challenge uh, so I'm not able to comment. Health lounges itself, as the 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 domain and the logo, it can be a lot. You can create all kinds of different products with this one. You can do as you're doing challenges. You can do conferences and like summits and things like this. You can do a lot of stuff with this. It just depends how big you want to go. So the brandability is ten. Sum up actions to take, just, just decide on your brand colors and model some other sites. Look at uh, different sites and see what they're doing, how they have laid out everything, um, and try to follow those. This content over here is good, but this over here is not quite nice. And yeah, so this lower part would need a bit more love. That's just ex actions I would I would this I would recommend you to take just to design uh, decide on your brand colors uh, and find a site and model the site model your competitors or or in a different niche just a site that you like uh, so that the layout will be matching and then you just pop in your content that you already have on here onto that layout. Um, yes, so. I will add on the last site because this is from one of the people uh, that I actually um, I actually communicated with before I became the community manager. This is John Ward, and I was helping him with with oh, with his uh, Groove Pages um, builder. And I respect him as a friend, and he actually helped me a lot when I was struggling and helping out in the group, and nobody saw me as an authority or an expert, and then he actually helped me through this. So thank you very much, John, for that. And this is the site he created. He has a, a skin or a skincare line in Genius, and his, his site is just awesome. I'm not saying this is because of me. I'm saying this is all on John and he created some awesome products and mock-ups and he's just giving it all. I can see that this is some professional work. Um, the goal of the site is immediately visible either to find out more or to actually purchase it. I want it now. I want it now. See all products. So what I think he is doing is he is creating his Groove Pages site, which will be connected to GrooveCart later on. And then he will be actually using the Groove Pages funnel or website and selling the products from GrooveCart. So GrooveCart will handle the uh, the product delivery, the shipping, the taxes, the, 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 the everything. And the page itself will be on Groove Pages, and you can do that one as well. Um, at this point, I don't see anything that is connected anywhere, but the page is looking very nice. Here we go, John Ward, here is it. Um, awesome. 
so goal of it is very apparent thrust factor from one to ten i would definitely purchase something from here the images are very nice the colors are on point the, the like i don't the, the logo is very clear nothing else is it's not only because we are friends with john i would i would say john your site looks bad you need to fix it and i would be the first person that would say that in case his site would be bad but i really don't have anything bad or any comment to say his site is looking very nice design is 10 the design of this site is 10 the the bottles are very nicely spaced out uh, the buttons are spaced out the buttons are following the same exact colors the fonts the the height of the of the 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 font is is the same i really don't have anything else to say maybe he created different okay yeah so he has other pages as well i'm not sure if he, cre he created his site himself or he actually hired some help to to uh, to do the site but anyway the site is very nice good job buddy so so far i don't have anything else to say brandability you can get into the skincare uh, business and do very well with this kind of site um, you could be later on in competition with Nivea and all these uh, bigger brands but I don't think you are want you want to focus on that I think you want to actually uh, handle the the little guys and and focus on on the smaller niches and smaller markets um but yeah ingenious could become a big brand later sum up actions to take <laughs> just to connect your buttons and start selling i don't have anything else to say um i really think that this site is looking beautiful good so that is it um i had a couple of other people that posted their sites i don't want to make this video any longer i will do last one thing and this is as i promised in the beginning i want to give you the link to the replay and the replay is live now so once you come over here to the to this site which is called okay perfect it is working so here is the replay link of the webinar last night with mike so click on this one you're the first people that have it and watch it make sure you watch it there's so much awesome stuff going on there so this was posted inside the groove digital academy um you need to log in in case you don't have an account make an account this is the groove funnels update the next six months development timeline if in case you're watching a replay you probably have some of these products available in case you're watching us live you really want to know what is coming in the next six months but yeah that is it for it for now guys um watch the replay and yeah see you in the group hopefully you haven't uh you have some successes to share with me maybe next time or inside the facebook group i'm always very happy when you uh, share your successes your builds your pages and your creations what you did uh so yeah Thank you very much for guys for watching watch the replay you will be extremely happy with your investment in this company see you bye bye